What's up, guys, and welcome back to Earth Zero. I'm your host, the Black Nick, and thank you so much for tuning in. Please hit that like and subscribe button. So last time we did react to the I think I was, it was a teaser for the Hellboy Crooked Man, and it did not look good, you know. But um, you never know. Uh, I might ch we might change our minds after we've seen the movie. I'm not sure. Maybe they're keeping all their budget towards you know actually making the movie look cool. But I know it looks like a it's probably a low budget movie. So I'm going to, I'm going to you know criticize it and judge it from the budget that it received all in all. And um. Like I said, I think it still kind of works, you know, because it kind of, with the low budget and the indie kind of feel, indie film kind of feel that I got from it last time, I, I, I think it works well with, like, Hellboy. We don't need all these miraculous huge budgets and buildings and everything. I feel like a very, like, just main focus, small area kind of uh, movie in, like, some haunted forest and Hellboy coming through, like, like the previous trailer gave us, can work, if you know what I mean. So let's just see what this one does, and let's react, guys. There's something going on here. I need to understand it. Use this actor again. I do Dude, what's a jack it's exactly why you shouldn't be here. Jeez. You might say a demonic entity falls under our expertise. Catch up entertainment. Man's waiting on you. That's interesting. Okay, the snake looks a little bit better compared to last time. Oh, you didn't want me to squash? No, squash is good. No, I think it could it be pretty decent. Most just called him the crooked. You see, now there's uh, where you like the pay. The budget is well, not good. That train of. keeps throwing you off. Can you hear something? Your road ends in the dark like mine. Let's just keep on coming. It ain't even really the good. Jeez. Now this looks creepy. Come on, Snake. Let's rattle. And I feel like the guy playing Hellboy is actually Your doing a good job. Trouble. Yeah. By way they know not. Yo. I will make the dawn and the fire. Mm. <laughs> Just in case. Yes, man. Isn't that Hellboy without his gun? That actually looks much better than the first trailer we got. I don't know what was cooking up in that one. But I think it's the CGI moments that ruined it for everyone. And I think it ruined it mainly. Snake looks better. The fire and the train do not look good. I hope... They can do something about it in the process of making this movie just to touch up things over there. I, and, and that's what I'm just saying. Like, if those small things didn't really spit out, like, yo, this is low budget, I don't think people would have been that critical about the previous one. But the previous trailer made it look low budget F. But this looks so much more better. Like I said, I like the idea where it's all just going to be in this forest and this camp and they're probably asking Hellboy to come and chill with them to sort it out and it's just going to be like some cool solving crime kind of Hellboy movie you know and um I like it I like it being compressed and small but the fact that even though it's a small budget I just you know hope that the small things where they use their actual budget like the VFX can get polished 
and look good that it just doesn't throw you off the movie and so forth but but this looks way better than that winnie the pooh movie or that winnie the pooh movie was terrible but anyway um tell me what you guys think in the comment section below could this movie be good i'm definitely giving it a watch hope you guys do as well see you in my next video